Hello, how are you today? Hi, teacher. Hi, how are you? Fine, and you? I'm fine. Nice to see you. Mm. You have a good day? A hard day. Ooh, sorry to hear that. <laughs> Que nos estamos, estamos haciendo los, los preparativos para mudarnos de la, de bodega. Ouch. Ya. Yeah. Entonces estamos bastante atareados con eso. Wow. Yeah, that's a terrible job, right? Lots of things to move. But you will be better in the next building. Yes. Oh, that's the important. The big, big uh, warehouse. It's bigger. Uh, yes. That's much better then. Uh, but of course, it's not easy, right? Moving, moving is never, never easy. Never easy. I have a. Uh, 40 million de, de unidades. My God. And you have to move everything. Yes, 40 mi million de units. Of course, that must be kind of tidying. Yes. And when are you supposed to finish? In the July, approx. So that means that you're just beginning. Yes. Oh my God. So long walk to come. It's a uh, very, very hard in the move in the movements. The movements is uh yes, moving is one of the most difficult things that you can do. It doesn't matter if you move to another house or if you move from one building to another building in a company that always moving is really, really hard and really stressing because there are so many things to move that you feel that you never finish, right? But if you're going to be in a good place, in a better place, that's what is said. That's the most important thing. Definitely. Okay, what about the others? Did you have a good day or you had a hard day too, like David? Mm -hmm. How was your day? Nice? Hard day, teacher. Okay. Oh my goodness. I thought you would tell me, yeah, we had a nice day. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, today we have lots of things to learn, lots of things to do. So I hope you enjoy all the things that you will be learning today. Let's see, I'm going to call attendance right now. Let's see, Anna. Carolina, Edwin Mauricio, present teacher, Stacy Hill, 
Grace. Present teacher. Isabel. Present teacher. José Alfredo. Present teacher. Voy a tener la cámara apagada porque voy para la casa. Ok, ok. Juan José. Present. Karen. Present teacher. Carla Lorena. Hello. Present teacher. Luis Elgardo. Present teacher. Luis Mauricio. Present teacher. Marina. Present teacher. Noé David. Rosa Ida. Present. Present means David. Present teacher. Aquí vamos a ver. Teresa de Jesús. Noé. Carolina. Present teacher. Ana. Okay. Well. Let's see what you remember about yesterday's class. Mm -hmm. We're going to complete these sentences using so or so sh. So or so sh. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Anybody? Let's see number one. Number one. Okay, I'm going to give you a couple of minutes then for you to think and answer the exercise. What is the best teacher? Sorry. Excuse me? What is the best? Or, or what is the exercise? You see the presentation? Uh, okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. <coughs> Samantha is. So beautiful. I think. <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. Samantha is so beautiful. So, mm -hmm. She's such a nice woman. Nice woman. Such. She's such a nice woman. Paris is so beautiful. Paris is so 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 big or so big? so big. I don't remember. So big. So, <laughs> so big. Yeah. 
It is Maybe such, such a large city. 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 Mm -hmm. Ooh. It was. It is such a large city. Such a large city. Okay. What about the next one? It was, it was such, such a bad, bad day. day. Such. Okay. Such. Such a bad day. Mm -hmm. It was it so was windy. windy. It was. So windy. It was so windy. Yeah. It was so bad day. It was so windy. The those are windy. It's so. So lovely. So lovely. They are and they are so good so dogs. They are so huge dogs. Don't say such such words. Don't say such words. You shouldn't be. Oh. Oh. So good. You shouldn't be so good. I, I cut a couple more exercises for you here. The previous ones were easy because you know one has to be so and the other has to be such. But there's the other. They have no connection one with the other, right? So each of them is isolated. So you say, I'm so excited about my trip to Canada, or I'm so excited about my trip to Canada. I'm so excited. Yes. I'm so excited about my trip. <laughs> what about number two? It's so such a shame you could make it the party. It's such a shame you could make it to the party. Right? It's such a shame. So it's a shame you couldn't make it to the party. It worked so hard on that hotel. Okay, he worked so hard. Uh, the mouse. So hard. He worked so hard on that proposal. He such an amazing cook that I always ask him for receipts. Mm -hmm. Yeah, such an amazing cook. Okay. What about number five? It always, it always takes so much longer to get there when you drive. Okay. So much longer to get there when you drive. We have had so much. So much rain lately that mm -hmm. the road is good. Um, what about number seven? So much, so much more. Yes, the shape yes, they, they, they could get their project done. So much more. So much more. 
so much more cheaply. Like cat. Like cat. Right, right? Such. Such. Cats have such gorgeous eyes. Okay. Pretty good. No questions. <laughs> nice, nice. Okay. Well. Today we are going to start with a conversation. Check. Ready, ready for the conversation? Yes, oh, teacher. Yeah. Yes. Now, yes, teacher. Now you can check it in the in the book, right? That's page page forty one in your manual. Page forty one. Okay, repeat after me. The sales were not so good this month. The sales, sales were, were not, not so good, 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 good this month. Good this month. Therefore, 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 increasing our sales is our target this month. Do you have any idea about what to do? Do you have an idea about what to do? Have to, to demand 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 on each oh. sale. Oh. So, good idea. That a good idea. Good idea. Good idea. Also, also, oh, I'm also, in 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 Money. However, 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 we're getting a bank loan for that. I prefer getting a bank loan for that. For that. So, but I know that we can pay the bills we get. I'm concerned about us. I'm concerned about, asking, about for money. asking for money. But let's try it out. Let's, let's, try, it out. Out. let's okay. try it out. Try it out. One more time. The sales were not so good this month. The sales were not so good this month. Therefore, 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 our sales is our target this month. Do you have any idea about what to do? Do you have any idea about what to do? What to do? Sure. 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 First, analyzing and keeping track on the incomes and outcomes. That's a good idea. That's a good idea. Also interesting. So I'm interested in buying raw materials. Also, I'm interested in buying raw materials. materials. So we save some more money. We save more money. So we save more money. More money. For a money. Money. Ma, mama. Like money. 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 However. 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 Getting a bank loan for that. 
Y preferring so getting, getting a bad, bad one for that. Yeah. For that. that. I know that we can pay it with the incomes we get. But, but I, know I know that I we can pay, pay it with, pay it with get the get incomes we get. We get. get. I'm concerned about asking for money. I'm, I'm concerned, concerned about, 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 about asking, asking for, money. for money. But let's try it out. But let's let's, try, out. It let's out. Try, try it out. out. Let's try it out. Okay. <clears throat> try it. Out. Try it. Try it. Now I'm going to be Hugo and you're going to be Milton. Ready? 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 Yes. Ready. Okay. <laughs> the sales were not so good this month. Therefore, increasing our sales is our target this month. Sure. First, analyzing and keeping track on the incomes and outcomes have to be on each on each phase. That's, That's a good idea. idea. Also, so buying raw materials. So we save more money. More money. However. I prefer getting a bank loan for that, but I know that we can pay it with the incomes we get. I am concerned, concerned about, 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 about that. Let's try it out. Let's try it out. Let's try it out. Okay, now you are Hugo and I am Milton. You begin one, two, three, go. The sales were not so good this month. This month. Have any idea about what to do? Sure, sure. In terms of analyzing the impact of the outcome of the mandatory sales. That's a good idea. Also, I'm interested in buying raw materials, so we save more money. However, I prefer getting a bank loan. I know that we will pay it with the income we get. I'm concerned about asking for money, but let's try it out. Okay. Very good. Now, Che, I'm going to send you to the groups. So you practice this conversation and then you answer these questions. Okay, you have three questions. What is what is their objective this month? They their possession, right? There is a mistake here. It's correct. What is their objective this month? What are some steps they want to follow? And what is they worried about? Okay. Questions, questions? No. Okay, perfect. Let's see, I'm going to send you in pairs. We need to make eight groups. There you go. Page forty one. Join.
parte vamos a poner. Sí. Ya está. Sí, desde ahí es donde dice increasing. Increasing. Observe is all. What are some what are some slip slip the one to to foyum? Well Teacher, yo estoy solo. Ya, me lo voy a llevar. Oye, Hello. Hello. estaba con David, pero como que le falló el inter. No, Vámonos. yo me lo llevé. Me lo llevé porque vi. Ah, ah, usted se lo llevó. No, usted no había entrado. No, y es. Entonces me lo llevé. Es que entré dos veces. Ah, entré dos veces porque como que me está fallando también la conexión. Este, en eso ha de haber sido que, que se pueda vivir, que usted se lo llevó. Me lo voy a llevar. Porque Grace no pudo entrar. No, no. Vaya, está bien. Trate de que no va a llamar para que se pueda. Grando aquí. Teacher, nos tiene castigados. Ay, no le creo. No nos ha dejado compartir. <risa> okay. Hoy sí ya. Ahí está ya, Alicia. Ahí ya la compartió usted. Ya es, ya. Eso. Ah, pues ahí vamos. Ahí vamos ya. Ok. ¿Va a ser usted Hugo? ¿Mande? ¿Va a ser Hugo usted? Dele, yo soy Hugo. Ok. Eh, the seis were not so good this month. Eh, therefore, increasing our sales is our target this month. Do you have any idea about what to do? Sure. First analyzing and keeping track on the income and outcomes, how to be mandatory on HL. That's a good idea. Also, I'm interested in buying Conversation. Speaking, 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 practice. Practice the conversation first. Practicamos la conversación. Sí, sí, yo voy a hacer U. De acuerdo. These sales were not so good this month. Therefore, increasing our sales is all. Increasing, 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 sin n, yo le pongo n. Increasing, 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 diferente de nosotros, increasing, increasing. Teacher, ¿cómo este se llama? Bye. No, ¿cómo se llama? Money o money, ¿cómo se dice? Money. 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 Yes. ¿Y por qué siento yo que todo el mundo dice money, teacher? 
No sé, pero es Mani. Es Mani. Es que es una mezcla de O con A, pero hace más fuerza la A, ¿verdad? Exactly. Mani. 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 What are the some tips they want to follow? Money, money, money. Money, money. Money, money. Hay una canción de la que se dice. Money, money. Y solo eso me acuerdo. Oh, my Me voy a traer a Noé para que practique con usted. El number two. What are some steps? They want to follow. They want to follow. First, ¿Cuáles son algunos pasos? Keeping track on the incomes and our comes. Me imagino. Uh -huh. eh, ese sería un primer paso. ¿Cuál? Perdón, perdón. First, analyzing and keeping track on the incomes Incomes. and our comes. Mm. Incomes. 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 Incomes and Outcomes, 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 Así es la pronunciación. Es que como todos hablábamos, no escuché algunas pronunciaciones. ¿sí? ¿Cuál? En el último. I'm concerned about asking for money, concern. but let's try. Concern. 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 I'm concerned about asking for money. Money. <laughs> But let's, esta quiero pronunciarla igual que usted. But let's try it now. Let's try it. Let's try it. Let's try it out. Bueno, les voy a contar un truco. Ajá. Cuando eh, una palabra termina en consonante y la siguiente empieza con vocal, se, se unen. Mm. Try it. Try it, teacher. Try it. Try it. Try it. Try it. Let's try it. Try it. Try it out. Ajá, no dice let's try it, sino que let's try it. Let's try it out. Thank you, teacher, porque ese truco me complicaba let's siempre. Try it. Y mire, y se llevan el out también porque dice let's try it out. Try it out. Oh, but let's try it out. Try it out. Uh -huh. try como, out. como que let's se une out. todo. Ajá, uh -huh. exacto. Como que si fuera una sola palabra, try it out. Uh -huh. Try it out. Try Let's it out. Try it out. Okay. Noé, practicamos una vez. Ok. Sí, sorry que llegué por último. Aquí estamos. Demasiado. Ok. Ok. <risa> ok. ¿Usted es Hugo? Yo soy Hugo. Okay. <risa> ok. The sales were not so good this month. Therefore, increasing our sales is our target this month. Do you have any idea about what to do? Sure. First, analyzing and keeping. Cuaderno. Sí, yo también. Entonces quedaría. Bueno, el último quedaría concerned about asking for money. Concert. 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 Okay. Um, y si gusta, si gusta repitámoslo in... de nuevo. Teacher. What I say in, in, increasing. 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 Increase, increasing. 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 Ah, ok, ok. De, si gusta, repasémelo una vez más. Ok. Si quieres, tú comienzas. Com yo. Comienzo yo con Hugo. Ok. 
the sales were not so good this month. Therefore, increasing of sales is our target this month. Do you have a, do, do you have any idea idea about what to do? Idea, idea, idea. 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 Do you have any idea? Do you have do you have any idea? Idea. idea. Mm -hmm. Okay. About what to do. Sure. First, analyzing and keeping track on the incomes and outcomes had to be mandatory on each sale. Thanks. A good idea. Also, I interest. Tell interest. Interest. Aquí se se interest. haga de caso que la segunda e no existe. Dice interest. Interest. I voy in right materials, so we have more money. However, I prefer getting a bank loan for that, but I know that we can pay it with the incomes we get. I concerns about asking for money, but they treat it out. Mm -hmm. Okay, repeat, let's see, buying. 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 Raw materials. Raw. Raw, Raw. Raw materials. Cuando ven así, A y W es O. Como love. Raw. Love. Ok. Una O así abierta. O. Raw. 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 Raw materials. Raw materials. Okay. Ma, money. 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 How well. money. No, How ma, well. money. No money, sino que money. 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 Ah, uh, money. Money. <laughs> ¿Verdad? Money. <laughs> como, 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 que como money. Per... Money. Como money, pero sin acento. Money. Okay. Exactly. No es money, sino que es money. Money. Mm -hmm. Money. Money. Toda la vida lo dije mal. <laughs> money. However. 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 No. A bank loan. Se le corta. Long. A bank loan. A, a bank, a bank loan. loan. A bank loan. A bank loan. Interstell. Loan. Interstell. 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 I'm concerned. Con concerned. I'm concerned. I'm concerned. 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 Concern. Mm -hmm. Concern. Okay. Hey, excellent. Did you finish the questions? Yes. Uh, okay. Yes. Perfect, perfect. I'm going to take you out now then. Okay, bye-bye. Bye-bye. Vamos a ver, everybody here.
me falta Yuri, falta. Hija. Ok. Now, let's check your questions. Hmm. Just checking if some words in the pronunciation. Repeat target. 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 Idea. 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 Sure. 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 Any sure. Any idea. Any idea. Any idea. Any idea. Track. Truck. 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 Mandatory. 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 That's a good idea. That's a good idea. That's, 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 a good that's, a good that's a good idea. That's a good idea. That's a good idea. Row. 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 Check it. Row. 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 Hello. 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 Meow. Meow. Long. 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 No. 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 Concern. 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 No. 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 Money. 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 Try. 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 Let's try it out. Let's try it Let's try it out. Let's try it out. Try it out. Let's try. Out. 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 Therefore. 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 Okay, now let's go to the questions. Let's teacher, teacher, ¿qué significa therefore? Therefore es como de ahí. Right? Therefore. Because you say the cells were not so good this month. Como, de ahí, por eso. Right? It's too, it is used like for expressing consequence. Por esta situación es que. Mm, es, Incrementamos nuestros ventas. Sí. What does it mean, target? Target. Como un objetivo. 
Objetivo, exactly. That's like the objective. Mm -hmm. No es tarjeta, ¿verdad? Es, es, en este caso es como our target, eh, nuestro objetivo. Mm -hmm. Any other question? Yes, yes, I don't understand what is the meaning of the eh, no nos puede decir exactamente qué dice, ¿verdad? Pero no entiendo mucho la idea de cuando le dice de que, que, que tiene problemas. However, I prefer getting a part loan for that. Eso no entendí por qué se lo dice. Loan. A bank loan. A bank loan es un préstamo de banco. Uh -huh. Sin embargo, porque le dice eh, that first analyzing and keeping track, keeping track is like keeping a record on the incomes and outcomes is mandatory so no way tiene que hacerlo right on each sale then milton says that's a good idea also él está pensando en que hay algo más aparte de llevar ese track de todo also i'm interested in buying raw material o sea materia bruta ¿Sí? eh, eh, son son eh, companies by material that is already prepared, right? So it's less work probably, but it, at the end it is more expensive. So that's why it says, I'm interested in buying raw materials for my money. Para comprar materia, materia bruta, completa, para mejorar la ganancia. Sería como materia prima. Materia prima. Uh -huh, correcto, materia prima. Pero, pero, cru, pero en crudo, como para producir el producto completamente, right? Entonces, Eso cuando le dice, so we save more money, le dice para así eh, como ahorrar más dinero. Ahorrar más dinero, ajá. So, en este caso, este so no lleva el mismo contexto como cuando ayer. Esto es para hablar de o sea, como resultado de comprar la materia prima, vamos a ahorrar dinero. ¿Vale? Entonces, este SO no está enfatizando como lo vimos ayer, sino que este está en un contexto diferente. Y entonces le contesta, however, sin embargo, dice el otro, I prefer getting a bank loan for that. Porque él dice, no me quiero quedar sin efectivo. Yo prefiero conseguir un préstamo del banco para comprar la materia prima. Pero, dice al mismo tiempo, I know that we can pay it to the income. dice, o sea, eh, aunque para ahorrar dinero, comprar materia prima, ¿verdad? Pero dice él, sin embargo, yo prefiero un, un préstamo de banco para eso, para comprar la materia prima. Pero sé que el dinero que vamos a recibir no puede servir para eso. Right? So we can pay. We have enough money to pay for the raw material with the, with the income. Yeah. And the other says, I'm concerned about asking for money, but let's try it out. Yeah. Okay, now let's go to the question. What is the objective this morning? What is the objective? Increasing, Increasing our sales. To increase the sales, yes. What are some steps they want to follow? What are some steps? Analyzing, uh, keeping. Mm -hmm. Analyzing and? Um, and keeping. Keeping track, yeah. right? Keeping yeah. track of all the, the income and outcome. Okay. 
remember we were saying yesterday <laughs> that the only the only way to know if your company is functioning is by keeping a correct balance, right? So keeping a track. Okay, what is one of them? One of the guys who is the one of the guys is worried, right? What is he worried about? Milton. Mm -hmm. What is Milton worried about? Asking for money. He's worried about asking for money. So he, he doesn't like the idea, right? He doesn't like the idea of getting a, a, a bank loan. Why do you think he doesn't like it? What happens when you get a bank loan? They can um, can't pay it. You have to pay the incomes they get. Interest. You have to pay interest rate, right? Interest. And some rates are very high, right? Okay. Questions over there? No question. question okay no question, no question. okay and now we're talking about another topic check we're moving here we talk about gerunds gerunds and we are going to be using gerunds in three different situations that that <coughs> How do I form the gerund? Right? Okay, so you see some of the rules are the general rule of the ING form. Es lo normal, lo común hoy es ING. So you say feel. El verbo en forma base o en infinitive es así, ¿verdad? To feel, to feel, to work, to stay. Claro, cuando usted lo empieza a conjugar, le quita ese tú. Ya se pone lo que quiere. Vaya, to feel, to go, to work, to try. Entonces ese se convierte cuando tú lo quiero usar en ING o en ING form. No sé si soy yo, pero no le escucho. Es que hay un problema por ahí, hay un sonidito raro que no logro captar de dónde viene. Ahí está. Hoy sí, ya, ya bajó. Vale. Les decía, la forma más común de hacer el Jeron es adding ing so you say you add ing going feeling going working sleeping cooking right so if you say cook cooking yes working solo le agregamos ing that's it this is una but what happens if the verb finishes in E? Check. Sometimes the verb finishes in E. Then if the verb finishes in E, you eliminate the E and then you add ING. No decimos living, verdad? Sino que living. Living having, making, talking, or taking, right? Dancing. So you say dance, dancing.
Dancing. Tell me another verb that finishes in E. Smile. Mm -hmm. Driving. Drive, exactly. Drive. Driving. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. So save time. Hmm? Tell me no. Save. Fail. No, save. Save. Uh -huh. Save. Save. Uh -huh. Exactly. Save. Save. Exactly. So check. We eliminate the E and then we add I E. But no es la única regla. Hay, hay un montón de hecho. Yo me traje las más importantes. Nada más. Stop. ¿Se acuerdan? Cuando, cuando estábamos hablando de que en el, en el regular en pasado nosotros le, le agregamos una consonante extra. Pues aquí pasa lo mismo. So, if I have consonant, vowel, consonant, doblo la consonant antes de agregarle ing. Uh -huh. uh, sit, sitting, plan, planning, get, getting, swim, swimming. Doblamos Y aquí yo puedo decir dig. ¿Saben qué significa dig? Digging. No, teacher. Digging es escarbar. Por ejemplo, cuando su perrito sale al patio. A, a escarbar. O el gato. O el gato. Pero más los perros. Los gatos muy poco. ¿Verdad? Los gatos muy poco, pero, pero los perritos es así como que la mayoría. I don't have to go and I uh, cut. <laughs> Vaya, entonces. The power. <laughs> the cat, no, my pen. Ok, so, remember, consonant. Vowel consonant. Mire, consonant, vowel consonant, consonant, vowel consonant, consonant, vowel consonant, consonant, vowel consonant. I double the consonant and then I add a Y hay otro. Y ahora qué? If two syllables, if two syllable verbs end in a consonant plus vowel plus consonant, we do not double the final consonant. Entonces, dijimos, consonant, vowel, consonant, se dobla. Pero, si ese verbo no tiene solo una sílaba, sino que dos, entonces, no. ¿Ve? Solo le agrego I and G. ¿Sí? Si el verbo tiene una sílaba, le doblo la consonante. Si tiene dos sílabas, no. Entonces ahí venimos con travel. Travel. Traveling. Y aquí para esta, esta regla. Hay siempre hay excepciones y cuestiones donde, por ejemplo, simplemente no se puede. Por ejemplo, si yo digo play, 
no existen palabras con doble Y, ¿verdad? Entonces, play, play. Play, play. No le agrego otra Y. Igual fix. Fix es fixing. No le puedo poner otra X porque no existen palabras con doble X. Ok. Entonces, estas serían como excepciones a esta regla porque no existen. Entonces, Allí en inglés funciona mucho lo de cómo suena bien, cuál es lo lógico, cuál es lo normal. No se sale de los parámetros de las cosas que existen. Y esta es una situación. Yo no, no, no conozco palabras con doble y griega, ¿verdad? Entonces, en este caso, esta regla simplemente no aplica. ¿Ok? Estamos. Ya yes, teacher. Okay. Volviendo a esta, por ejemplo, en inglés británico, travel lleva doble L, pero en inglés americano no. Ok. Entonces allí ustedes ahí se acuerdan, si lo ven con doble L, uy, hay un error. No, está en británico, siempre. ¿Verdad? Porque en inglés británico le ponen doble L, pero en inglés americano. No. Vaya, vámonos pues. Now, why am I talking about that? Because vamos a pasar a tendas. <laughs> vamos a ver. En lo que asimila, en lo que acabamos de hablar, vamos por la tendas. Ana. Present teacher. Carolina. Present teacher. Edwin, ¿qué me Present teacher. <risa> no se le escuchaba. Y yo viendo lo que Edwin está escribiendo. <risa> Race. Race. Isabel. Isabel. Present teacher. José Alfredo. Present teacher. Juan Portillo. Present. Karen. Present teacher. Present teacher. Present, Luis Edgardo dijo, perdón, es que no se le escucha. Como que no se me escucha. Es que de repente se escucha como lejos. Interferencia. Uh -huh. Cierrenme los micrófonos, please, los que no están en el present. Thank you, thank you. Luis Mauricio. Luis Mauricio. Present teacher. Ok, Marina. Present teacher. Noé David. Presente, Y usted que se me había hecho. No estaba muerto. Andaba de parranda. Se me ha complicado algunas cosas, pero aquí estamos, Tichel. Ah, no estaba muerto, andaba de parranda. Ya andaba. Ya, vale. no, ya, no. ya estuvo. Ya no se me pierda. Rosa Hilda. Rosa. Presente, Tichel. Presente. Teresa de Jesús. Teresa. Teresa, sí se me ha perdido también. Yuri. Yuri, Yuri. Yuri, Yuri Alexandra. Presentes. Y okay, mientras no le digo a Alexandra, no hay presentes. Present, teacher. Ok. Great. Questions, preguntas, 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 preguntas de lo que estamos hablando. Uh -huh. 
question. ¿Estamos bien? Yes. Probably, probably yes. Probably. <laughs> Así que probably yes. It's an expression. <laughs> okay, probably yes. Probably yes. <laughs> A ver. Para qué usamos los gerunds? Era lo Por ahí ya tiene paso. Cierrenme el micrófono, Crisito. Yuri. Está. Vaya. Porque si no, no me van a escuchar. Vaya, che. How do we use germs? Estos son solo algunos de los usos de germs, ¿verdad? Bueno, aquí nos dice. After, a pre, after prepositions, pero vamos a ver after prepositions como. Si se fijan aquí hay un adjective y después está la preposition. En algunos casos tenemos noun y después preposition, or a verb y después preposition. Entonces, siempre que esté una preposition, el siguiente verbo, si va a usar un verbo, tiene que estar en ing. Hoy es la mandatory. Bueno, probámonos por el principio. As subjects. The subject, you know, the subject is always at the beginning, right? So we are going to use here eh, el ING o el gerund como un subject. ¿Ya? Yeah? So you say increasing ourselves is mandatory. Producing high quality goods is our target. En este caso, good no es el adjetivo o oh, ama good person. Good es un, eh, un bien. Estamos hablando de los bienes, ¿verdad? Que algunas empresas ofrecen bienes y otras ofrecen servicios. Right here, we're talking about goods, pero como bienes bienes o cosas materiales que tiene una empresa. Right? Uh, let's see. We'll come later to the others. When we are using gerunds, que casi que lo desaparece. When we are using gerunds, de repente, yo que se me hicieron todos. When we use gerunds as subjects, look at the example. It will be always at the beginning of the sentence and it will be part of the, or it will be the subject or sometimes can be a subject, a complete phrase, right? Building a career as an artist, todo este el sujeto. No solo building, right? Building a career as an artist was one of her biggest goals. Buying a house is his dream. Living in the city, in the city center, can be stressful. Smoking cigarettes is bad for you. Puede ponerle solo smoking, no hay problema, right? Smoking cigarettes is bad for you. Writing a poem was harder. Y otra vez, no importa en qué tiempo esté hablando. Estar hablando en presente, en pasado, en futuro, no importa, te hace mal, ¿verdad? Listening to music is very relaxing. Sleeping is hard when your mind is full of thoughts. Learning English, it's a good thing, right? Speaking English is sometimes difficult. Entonces, 
usamos el I and G at the beginning of the sentence. I don't know if that's clear. Yes. 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 ¿Quién dijo no? Isabel. No. no. For me, it's clear. Eh, I. Uh -huh. Tell me. What's um. your name? I don't know. Um, the channels uh, using only with a subject or when you channels. Can you repeat? Um, when when use a uh, channels only with subject or or another another uh, things we're just beginning this is the first one mm -hmm. this, is, this is the first of the uses of the gerunds mm -hmm. mm -hmm. so, sometimes when especially we use a gerund as a subject when a the subject is an activity. For example, if you say playing soccer is fun, right? Uh, running in the park is exciting. Cooking a delicious dish is fantastic. So it's, it's you are introducing here, basically it's an activity. Tell me, Anna. Okay. Es como si fuese implícito la acción en el sujeto. Implícita la acción. En el sujeto porque dice smoking cigarettes, cigarettes is bad for you. O sea, no, usted no lo traduce fumando cigarrillos es malo para usted, sino que el que está fumando. No es que se traduzca así, pero la acción va implícita en el sujeto. ¿Qué es el sujeto? No está implícita, sino que es. Su sujeto es la actividad. Como vaya, nosotros porque en, en español podemos decir fumar es malo. Mi sujeto sería fumar. ¿Sí? Entonces, escribir poemas es difícil. Writing poems. Es difficult. Entonces, este eh, no está implícito, sino que es. Este es el sujeto. La actividad es el sujeto. Entonces, por ejemplo, si yo digo, sleeping eight hours is good. Going to bed late every day is hard. Yeah. Singing is complicated. <laughs> Ok, entonces mi sujeto, mi sujeto es una actividad, entonces eh, por eso es que se empieza así con, con ING, porque es una, es una actividad el sujeto, y como las actividades son verbos, ¿verdad? los actions, pero en este caso no está funcionando el ING como verbo, sino que como noun, porque los sujetos son nouns. Uh -huh. Entonces aquí está buying, o sea, comprar, no lo, no lo traducimos como comprando una casa, sino que comprar una casa es su sueño. En vez de decir, his dream is to buy a house, ¿verdad? Si le damos vuelta, pero estamos poniendo el chieron al principio, ocupando el lugar del sujeto, o sea, actuando como un noun. ¿Ya? Can you think of other ideas here, other activities? What do you think about 
eating ice cream. Eating ice cream. Eating ice cream is? Delicious. Delicious, yes. Um, learning English. It's so important. It's important, it's so important. Okay, mm, cooking. It's expensive. Mm. Did I know? Hmm? No. No. Repeat. It's relaxing. Delicious. It's delicious. Relaxing. It's relaxing. Okay. Cooking paella can be difficult. No. <laughs> it's so very easy. I don't. Think it's a piece of cake. <laughs> I check. Puede usar el modal can o puede usar un verbo. Mm. Generalmente, si se fijan, es el público. Yeah. Eating too much can be unhealthy. Right? Eating, not eating enough is bad. Yeah. Learning another language will be very useful in the future. O sea, podemos usar future también. Siempre will be con el verbo to be, aunque esté en future, en paso, en person, right? No problem. Ahora, vamos al segundo. After some verbs. Check. Aquí tiene que tener mucho, 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 mucho cuidado. Hay verbos que no se pueden utilizar en ING form. ¿Sí? Y cuando nosotros... Ustedes ya saben que podemos usar el, el gerund para el present continuous, ¿verdad? Pero este no es el caso. ¿Sí? Este no es el caso. Aquí no estoy usando yo el present continuous donde usted dice, yo estoy comiendo. I am eating. I am cooking. I am dancing. No ese es el uso que le estamos dando. Aquí estamos hablando de, de, de los, del gerund después de algunos verbos. Hay verbos, bueno, cuando usted hace una oración con dos verbos, uno de los verbos tiene que ir, bueno, el segundo de los verbos tiene que ir, ya sea en gerund o en infinitivo. No puede solamente decir, I hate iron. Eso no es posible. I hate iron. Entonces, el segundo verbo o va con to, o sea, el infinitive, o va con ing, que es el gerund. Les voy a compartir después de la clase una, un, una información para que ustedes la revisen y vean qué verbos pueden ser utilizados en gerund, con gerund y qué verbos con infinitive. Pero estoy hablando del segundo verbo, si se fijan. I think that I prefer getting a long bang. I dislike fighting employees. I enjoy cooking. I love eating. I dislike eating garlic. Right? I have a couple of examples for you here. Check. Likes. I like, uh, look, likes playing video games. I hate packing suitcases. My favorite thing to do is reading. See? He loves telling the story. No digo he loves tell the story. Love es un verbo que puede ser seguido por ING o por to. 
he loves to tell the story or he loves telling the story, no hace diferencia. Pero hay algunos casos, como el caso de enjoy, usted dice, I enjoy working, no puede decir, I enjoy to work. Ok. I hate cleaning. I love listening. Ya. Yeah. And in some cases, the meaning will also change. Check the verbs you have here. Prefer. Prefer Gary. Prefer. I prefer getting a long fan. I dislike fighting. Si a este verbo, en vez de I prefer, le pone I would prefer. La historia cambia. Ahí ya no puede decir I would prefer getting. Sino que I would prefer to get. ¿Sí? Entonces, el uso va a ser totalmente diferente. Les voy a compartir un documento y quiero que lo revisen. Para que ustedes vean. Eh, que verbo hay un montón. Y más de alguna ocasión, nosotros vamos a usar dos verbos en la misma oración. Y ese verbo puede ir, estoy hablando del segundo verbo. Puede ir en gerund o puede ir en infinitive. Hoy nos vamos a concentrar solamente en verbos o en infinitive después de algunos verbos. Después de qué verbo usamos infinitive. Vamos a ver. ¿Quién me dice? Después de qué verbo usamos infinitivo. De todos, sí, De todos. No después de todos. Regular. Después de. Regular, ¿verdad? Ajá. Vamos a ver qué dice la dice. Okay. So you say, admit, avoid. For example, if you say, she avoided, she avoided going out with him. She considered moving. Yeah. She denied telling a lie. She continued telling the story. She recommended going to a good restaurant. She suggested staying at a five-star hotel. Pues, eh, allí ustedes van a ver cómo, cómo funciona la, 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 la información y cómo después de cierto verbos usted ocupa o Jaron, o infinity, pero no hay manera de decir, ah, yo no quiero ocupar yero no infinity, no puedo poner nada. Solo I enjoy go. Uh -uh. I cannot say I enjoy go. O sea, I enjoy going. I, I love listening. I hate cleaning. Right? I like playing. I like cooking. I don't mind going out late. I don't mind es uno de los verbos que podemos utilizar aquí. I don't mind. I don't mind going out. I don't mind going out. Late. Uh -huh. I don't mind going out late. Uh -huh. Entonces usamos el gerund después de alguno verbo. What is the other one? Check. Prepositions. What happens with the prepositions? After is a preposition. Before is a preposition. By 
all without of about at for in entonces son prepositions check yo digo puedo tener una preposición solita right like in this case after having a shower I waited for Stephen. The tablet must not be taken before getting up in the morning. Right? The tablet must not be taken before getting up in the morning. I manage it by working much longer than 40 hours a week. By working. What was her reaction on hearing the news? You hear the news, right? He told the joke without laughing. Check. So I have, I cannot say without laugh or without to laugh or after have, that's not possible. So every time I have a preposition, I'm going to use the verb with ing. They are afraid of. Teacher, disculpe, en la lámina anterior, mm -hmm. dice, he told the joke without laughing. Laughing. Ajá, podría traducirse como, él dijo la, el, la, él hizo la, él dijo el chiste sin reír, o sin reírse. Sin reírse. Sin reírse. Now, check, aquí solo tenemos preposition, right? But here, you have adjective plus preposition. They are afraid of losing the match. They are afraid of losing the match. Pat is angry about working in the rain. John is good at working. What are you good at doing? What are you good at? Hmm? I'm good at working in the garden. I'm good at cooking. We am not good at singing. Right? What are you good at? Después de la preposition at, I'm going to use ing. The girl is crazy about playing tennis. The girl is crazy about running in the park. The girl is crazy about dancing. Yes. He's disappointed about seeing such a bad report. About seeing. He's disappointed about seeing. He's disappointed about listening to the music. He's disappointed about watching the people cry in the middle, <laughs> right? <clears throat> we are excited about making our own film. What are you excited about? Hmm? What are you excited about? Who can tell me? Yes, yes. I'm excited. You're excited about? Finishing this week. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. I'm excited about finishing this week. Sandy is famous for singing songs. Are you famous? What are you famous for? What are you famous for? Uh -huh. I'm oh, famous for? Uh -huh. Tell me something.
I'm famous for. Singing songs. For singing songs. Okay. The children are not happy about seeing a doctor. Because that means injection, right? The children are not happy about seeing a doctor. Are you interested in grading points? What are you interested in? Hmm? What are you interested in? Questions? In sewing so, in so in clothes? In? Sewing so clothes? Okay, in sewing so clothes. Nice. Okay, wow. Okay, okay. What about the others? What are you interested in? I interested in learning English. Okay, great. What are you angry at? Angry about? What are you angry about? Are you angry about something? Mm -hmm. No? Never angry? Okay, what are you afraid? I'm angry to getting late to my work. Okay, I'm angry about getting late to work. Yeah. Yes. What are you afraid of? I'm afraid of. Mm -hmm. I'm afraid of being bite with. <laughs> I see by, by a scorpion or being bitten by a scorpion. And this is the time of the scorpions, right? Especially when it is windy. Okay. Are you excited about something? What are you excited about? Hmm? I'm excited about. going to bed early. <laughs> yes, I think everybody. Okay, what are you excited about? I go to bed before me. What are you excited about? I'm excited about yes, about watching movies, about singing, about yes. listening to music. Okay. Great. Now, let's we'll go to the manual. Check. What you're going to do here is complete this exercise. Have mini conversations, right? You have ask, give, pay, have, buy, get, buy. Now you know the rules on how to make verbs in I. Go ahead, let's complete it. I'm going to send you I'm going to send you in group of three Sorry, my math is not so good today. Let me see. Uh -huh. One group. One group of four. And all the others will be group of three. There you go.
complete exercise five. Noé, Marina. Uy, en el mismo grupo estaban. Marina, Marina, hello. Voy, teacher, voy, voy, voy. Can we begin the verb when compare with the partner? That is the exercise. Exercise five. Mm -hmm. Do we start? It is a como paying. We start. This is how in the tarea giving to Christmas week. Weeks of. We start giving to Christmas off. Giving, sería. Creo que sí. De Navidad. Ajá. Ok. Dos semanas. Trabajar. Sería I prefer, I prefer. Sería paying. Then to work on more yeah. with plus a bonus. ¿Qué dicen, chicos? Bueno, llenémoslo y después vemos si, si estaría bien. Va, en la segunda. Sí, es así. <ríe> Correcto. Va, en la segunda. Are you interested in new ideas? Interesado. Ahí quizás sería, ¿verdad? En, mmm, ¿Será get? ¿En obtener nuevas get, ideas? Getting, ajá, obtener nuevas ideas. Getting. Getting, getting sí. Ok. Get. Yes. And do you have? I know. Yes, I am. Do you have? Uh -huh. eh, teacher, este no sé cómo se pronuncia, pero H I R E aire o gire higher 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 igual y se mire contratar Thank you. Fire, fire <laughs> con F is to say it. Fire. Como de fuego. Uh -huh. Oh. Hi. Hi. Quizás sería entonces, yes, I am, do you have? I long... Giving so I love que giving you uh -huh. provide 
el Gerund de Provide, proporcionar algunos, porque si yo estaría encantado de proporcionar algunos. Algunas, ah, ok. Proporcionar el, el, el Gerund de Provide. Eh, el Gerundio Pro, sería Provin, no. Provin o Providing. Providing. That's providing. No. I love this. Aquí sí sería. Veamos. No really, I'm more concerned about nuevas ideas para un Facebook. Are you interested in porque provide no como no puede ser proporcionar ese es provide ese es como proveer como proveer nuevas ideas para un producto exacto bye uh -huh. sería así providing providing, providing. Se la va a copiar porque no tengo idea. Sí, pero sí. Recuérdese que cuando termina en I, en E, la termina. No estoy diciendo en inglés. La terminación es en I. No, pero así es, providing. Así como lo he escrito. Entonces dice: Yes, I am. Do you have I love I love uh -huh. Uh -huh. good your stuff Does, okay. teacher hello hi Very what's good. the meaning he, here teacher esta here higher 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 contratar Contratar. No sería giving. Giving. Como que decir que... No sé. Me gusta dar algunas ideas, no sé. ¿Así? Ah, Quiero ver cómo se traduce ahorita. Ya lo estaba viendo la teacher que está haciendo trampa. Híjole, no, pero eso no es trampa, solo es... <risa> <risa> es una investigación. Ah, bueno, pues. Viéndolo de esa forma está bien. <risa> Dar, giving, dando un poco, algo. Me encanta no, no, no. dar un poco. Mm. Y no podría ser también como as o aplicará mejor a otro. No, pero es que no le va ah, a dar el salario a los empleados. Usted se los tiene que dar. Ajá. Ajá. Sí, es cierto. Ah, pues no, giving. Sí. Giving some. Mm -hmm. Ok. Okay. Mm -hmm. Aquí sí sería, ¿verdad? Bye. Teacher. Sí, te... Y hemos agarrado llave. Sí. A ver, a ver, a ver. 
la primera. Porque le, le estamos intentando llevar sentido, ¿verdad? Pero uh -huh. no le damos el sentido. O sea, si le ponemos, vamos a tener dos semanas de vacaciones por la Navidad. O comenzamos, a, pe Navidad. O comenzamos a pedir. Pero le suena a usted la conversación uno que los que están hablando son los jefes o son los empleados. Son los empleados. Are you sure? No, son los jefes. Uh -huh, porque el trabajo dice. Que vean la respuesta. Uh -huh. I prefer them to work more with more week plus bonus. One more week plus bonus. I prefer, teacher. I prefer. I prefer. Se fue el verbo que les falta. Them to uh -huh. work one more week plus a bonus. Ok. Uh -huh. I prefer si de los jefes paying yeah. then to work more with the bonus. Pero entonces tendría que cambiar el primer verbo. Correcto. Entonces sería eh, dar Carry. Sería give, 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 pero give, no get, ¿verdad? Giving, ¿verdad? Do we start giving to Christmas? Weeks off. I prefer pay, paying than to work one more week plus a bonus. Are you interested in okay. in aquí podría ser oh, in, in tener Getting, obtener nuevas ideas de producto. Yes, I am. Do you have? I love. I love some. Quiero ver. I love selling, 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 tal vez. No, no sería selling. Le veo más lógico. A selling. Sí. Va a mandar, va a vender las ideas. Ajá. Le encanta. Sí. Veale también el, el significado de cada verbo, ¿verdad? Para que vean cómo le Sí, porque dice, I am, do you have, porque aquí dice, are you interested in getting new, new ideas for products? Yes, I am. Do you have, le pregunta si tiene. I love. Mm, I love having, ¿no? Quiero ver. Vamos a ver si hay sentido de la conversación. El ojo de me encanta tener algunas, creo que es. Yo le daría vuelta. ¿Al cual, teacher? ¿Are you interested in having new ideas for products? Ok. Y después, do you have? I love getting some. Uh -huh. Y vamos a ver, tenemos ya give. Oh. Tenemos pay. Oh. 
Mm -hmm. Having. Oh. Getting. Ok, nos faltan esos. Ok, selling sería. Tener. Uh, 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 so aquí sería proveer. Provide. Providing. 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 Salaries to employ each month is a prioridad. O sea, es prioridad eh, dar a los empleados cada mes. Eh, I totally agree with that basis. A new worker has to another one. Bueno, esto ya está. Aquí sería as, mira. Porque le está preguntando a los nuevos trabajadores. Así que. Entonces. Ya llamamos a skin. Nos falta as. Heren. Irin. Que Irin oh. es. Hiding. Hiding, hiding, Apoyo ah, sería hire. Hiring. Hiring, ya. Yeah. Mm. Are you worried about? Ahí sería paying. <laughs> Are you worried about paying the bank for the new loan? Algo así como que estás como curado acerca de tu pago en el banco para. Sí, está preocupado por. por Ajá. El... No, really, I'm not concerned about. Provide the new products to pay. Pero entonces en la 3 de. Sí, le tendríamos que quitar ese. O sea, o aquí o en el otro. Entonces Ajá. sería giving salaries to employees. En la 3 sería giving. Puede ser aquí, give. No, sí, ¿verdad? Giving. Sí. Are you worried about paying the bank for the new loan? No, really. It's more considered about... About... Selling, quizás es ahí, ¿verdad? Selling sí. the new loan to buy the employee. Aquí. Sí. Aquí sería selling. Selling. Uh -huh. Y entonces aquí sería Are you standing in? Give ask. Ah, no. Sí, ask. Ajá. Uh -huh. Providing. Providing. Ah, sí, pues. ah, sí providing. En Darbo con ask. ¿Cuál? Sí, pero ask. ahí quedan bien. Providing. Ajá, queda bien providing. Amo decir es o hacerlo. Uh -huh. Yes, I am to have a Hey, me lo llevo. ¿Cuál es la
Bye, teacher. Ah, no, todavía no. Present, ¿Eres? teacher. Ah, no. <risa> Vamos a dormir, teacher. Let's go to sleep. Vaya, let's see here. Do we start? Ay, no quiere la Having. No. Hasta la compu quiere dormir, ya ve. No, qué barbaridad, qué barbaridad. Ya casi compu, no te trabes para que nos vayamos a rápido. Vale, let's see. Do we start? Having to. Giving to Christmas with off. To Christmas weeks off. Son los jefes los que están hablando, ¿verdad? I prefer Hi. paying them to work one more with plus a bonus. I prefer paying them to work one more week plus a bonus. Okay. Are you interested in Having, having new ideas for products. ¿Estás interesada en tener nuevas ideas? Having, right? Yes, I am. Do you have? I love getting some. Getting mm -hmm. some. I love getting some. So please give me some, right? Um, hmm. uh, what about number three? Providing, yes, providing salaries to employees, providing salaries to employees each month is our priority. I totally agree with that. Besides, hiring, hmm? hiring, hiring, ah, perdón, hiring, hiring new work hiring. has to be new a worker. Has to be another one. Okay. Sorry. Okay. Yes, yes. Thank you. Are you worried about asking, asking, uh -huh. asking the plan for the, the new? Not really. I'm more concerned about. The new products to pay the employees. Yes. About selling the new products. Nice. Question. We just thought in the look. No. <laughs> Question. Mm -hmm. No questions? I don't know, teacher. No, teacher. At 10, at 10 p.m., we don't have any questions. No, we don't have any questions at that time. I agree with you. Pasha, vamos a ver. De las achenas. No, teacher. No, no. Ana. No. Present teacher. Carolina. Present teacher. Edwin. A lo cierto que lo dice empresa y se van desconectando. Man. Grace. <laughs> Grace. Grace. You watch me. <laughs> Watching you. Isabel. Present teacher. José Alfredo. Present teacher. Juan José. Present. Karen. Present teacher. Carla Lorena. Present teacher. Luis Edgardo. Present teacher. Luis Mauricio. Present teacher. Bye teacher. Marina, Marina. Estoy presente, teacher. No, presente. Noé. Noé, Noé. Present teacher. Okay. Raina. Present teacher. Teresa de Jesús. Julia Alexandra. Present me. Felipe. 
Present teacher. Vaya. Se han acabado los programados. Do I have a volunteer to stay? No volunteer. Si gusta, yo no se la ves. Ok, perfecto. Ok. Bueno, see you. Bye. 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 Las más aguas, por fin. Para que me diga que ya me pudiera dormir. Ay, sí. Ya hoy ya podríamos dormir en paz. Solo me hace falta la de mañana, que esa no la entendí. Dormir en paz, Mauricio. Sí. La de mañana sí no la he entendido. De ahí incluso adelante la tarea 20. Vamos a llamar a ver cómo está la bien. Ahí está. Okay. Ah, sí, veo que ya llegó chico a la cuarta. Ya, ya ve. Eso. Ya me puedo ir. Ya, ya me pudiera dormir tranquilo, ¿verdad? Ya pudiera dormir tranquilo. El fin de semana me hace el examen hoy para que duerma Macalá. Perfecto, sí. Mañana complemento la que me hace falta y comienzo a adelantar el examen. Lo no, voy a terminar. ¿De qué se trata la que no entendió? Eh, es la de mañana. Es una de la tarea 19. Es de ir complementando con los verbos correctos. Provide and the correct verb. Sí, my turn. Ah, sí. Conditionals. Conditionals. Mm -hmm. Okay. Conditionals. Mañana veremos conditionals. Okay. okay. Conditional. Si no me equivoco. It's very easy. Sí, it's very easy. Eso ok. Sí. Ok. If we have low assets, we have to even. Appraises. We have to even appraises. Sí, es el conditional one. Que va. Eh, sí, lo dice. Present, present. Ah, pues sí. In this part. You get the verb in present. So present, present. For example, you say, if I don't have breakfast, I get a headache. If I get up too late, I feel lazy the whole day. Yeah? Okay, yeah. If I go to bed too late, I feel tired the next day. So present, present. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you have any questions about today's class? So the, the... Mm, no, no questions. No questions, nice. Nice, nice. Ah, pues ese, ese de los conditions, bueno, lo que puede ir haciendo, si tiene energía. <laughs> Ahora créame que ay, ya necesito dormir. No, y la ir adelantando el, el examen. Desde las 7 de la mañana estoy en reuniones. Sí, no, o sea, sí. ya la computadora no, ni la no, quiero mañana. ni ver, ya. Mañana. Sí, mañana. Mañana. Esta está fácil. Eh, la primera parte. ¿Del examen? Del examen. Mm -hmm. It's using eh, have and has to, don't have to, doesn't have to. 
That's okay. the first part. The next part is about Ah, ok, ok. Sí, es verdad, está fácil. La primera, la segunda también. Sí, la segunda también. That's about going to. Ok. Sí, y la última, ok, de condi conditional, ¿verdad? The last one. Okay. The last one. Part three is about the simple past. Part three. Ok. Me va a dar puntos si lo hago mañana, entonces. Así ya queda tu nombre. La parte 4 está súper fácil. Sí, a la vez. Ya vio, vea. Sí. So, asoch, so asoch and the last two questions are about conditionals. Claro. But the first three are so and so. Very good. Ok. Bueno, será problema de Luis Edgar de mañana. Ya. Yeah. That's it's it's very easy, so it won't give you more okay. much complication. Yes. But, but thank you, Edgardo, for completing it because like okay. that I can easily come and collect your information and complete the complete the list with your brain. Okay. <laughs> so I'm sorry for the leave leave Como sería? Lead day. Uh -huh. uh, sorry for the lead day. Uh, so day. Sorry. Yeah, for the delay. Okay. Ya, ya, ya me puedo poner días en las tareas atrasadas. <laughs> ah, sí, porque 96 tienen. Entonces, tienen. Ok. 96. Uh -huh. Ok. Bueno, good night, teacher. Ok. Thank you. Have a good night and see you tomorrow then. Tomorrow. Yes. Bye. Bye-bye. Take care. Vamos a actualizarlo de una vez.